Hey Realm Walkers, I'm Saratus Orbis, and I hope you're having an awesome day today. And if not, well, come and escape with us anyways. This is episode 6 of Stranded Among the Realms, which is an, an extreme difficulty playthrough of Nightingale. And we've been having a blast so far. Although I gotta say, before we get into it, last episode I made a boo-boo. A lot, a big boo-boo. And that is... I was walking around going, where's the Realmic Transmuter? Where, where is it? And it, I didn't realize that they're actually in the Fey Portals. Or Fey Towers. The thing that's in front of us right now is one of these Fey Towers. And the Realmic Transmuter is up on top of it. And not only that, but the Realmic trans trans bleh. The Realmic Transmuter only is like just hanging out in the middle of nowhere in the Abeyance Realm. Um, because there's no Fate Tower in the Abeyance Realm. So that's what we're going to do today. We're going to attempt to get through this Fate Tower. And it's going to be... It's going to take the entire episode, probably. It might even go into episode 2. Um, it, it's... It's probably going to be pretty challenging. So... I suppose we can get right into it. Um, just checking all my stats. Everything's good. Let's do this. We got a minute left on our food, so we may as well refresh now. Let's actually have. Um, put up, up, up. Let's have some meat and some more meat, and hopefully this will. These veggies will overwrite the old veggies. Hopefully, right on. Nice. Get the axe out, and this guy out. Those are traps. There's another trap. Gotta get, gotta get after those guys first. One guy just just disappear. <laughs> Let's slug down some health because we got a little bit pieced up. Hey, I was blocking. Die. Let's go where please. They step behind you. You know what I mean? Like when they're in front of you, they end up behind you somehow. 
Like when they make their big swing against you and they're crouched down, somehow they end up crossing this path behind you. And it's kind of frustrating because I'm swinging in the front and always misses because they're always passing right by behind. Alright. Oh, I can't do anything to these traps. There is something I want to try and I attempt to detonate these. But the problem is when you dodge them, it doesn't trigger them. And the reason why I want to try that is it'll... Hmm. It's so sketchy. I think I have to be right on top of it to trigger it. Yeah. What about this one? Ooh. Oh, but we still got hit. Yeah, we got hit by that one. So that's not good. Because I was hoping at the very top of this, there's going to be this huge fight. And it is very, very painful. Because there's so many of them. And I'd like to be able to trigger these so that... I like to be able to trigger, trigger the trap so it destroys some of what we're fighting up there. But if we can't do that... I don't know. I wish that they also triggered the traps, because that would be great. Thirty-two tier one essences, which we should We should probably go for, go get. What? That was weird. You were rubber banding there for a second. Yeah, the best way past these is to just jump right here. You do a dodge. Um. Oh. That's weird. That doesn't lead anywhere? It should. We're supposed to go this way. First time I went I went through this in my other game, I got hurt so much <laughs> trying to get past these these traps. It took me a while to figure out oh just dodge past them. You don't want to get get hit by that one. That one's an acid trap and it stays with you. Back in there by accident. <laughs> did I lose myself? I think I did. I'll go this way, right? <laughs> no. This one really came in from. Oh my god. Oh shit. Yeah, don't step in there because, yeah, poison.
take those essence buttons. Okay, here we go. Now we can do this two ways. We can try and do... We can try and melee them. Or we can try to range attack them. There's no, um... There's no thing that to bomb us. That's nice. That's very nice. Oh, shit. I want to see if that affected him. I don't think it did. Okay. Oop, they're empty. The problem is, like, it's so easy to get swarmed here. Oops, missed. That was a bad shot. Let's use this so we can dodge. Oh, I hit that again. Like a dummy. Hard to hit without a reach too. But I can't dodge with the axe. I have to run. Oh my! I need to be careful of that. I keep hitting it. How are we gonna do this? How can we do this better? Because we're not able to peel any away. Let's at least try and thin one in. Or we can miss. Oop. I wouldn't have fired. Fire? There we go. Spent all of that. Okay, need to. Uh oh.
Oh no. That was a bad time to look. Ah. Why did they stop screaming? Oh no. It's kind of eerie not hearing them. Uh, that must be an audio bug of some kind. Oh my god, there's so many of them. on the wall. Such an annoying fight. But thankfully it didn't take all goddamn day. Thankfully. Because that would have been awful. Also, we're getting some frame skips? That's kind of weird. I don't know. Let's release the hope echo. We got a crew T set. Very nice. Okay, we could change the realm now. Um, what do we put in here? Dragon's Horde, maybe? Ooh, a dragon's horde eminent. I think we we hang on to these two. Uh, let's do the treasury card, maybe. Mm, I don't know. Let's wait. Let's wait a moment. And our synchronous loader. What's this? Intrepid fleshling. Claiming bounty from atop the long forgotten obelisks of fairer folk. Yet hast thou any inkling of what thou holdest cupped in mortal mitts? The synchronous lotus is no simple bauble, but a potent fay bijou, filled to bursting with a mere sliver of the realm's magic. 
It is the scavenged foundation upon which your kind so often builds their fanciful toys. Forget not that it was we who bestowed magic unto man. Without such generosity, what might the children of Earth have been reduced to? Don't know. Wait, hold on. If we take this logically, the same, the same magical wilds that the, that presented us our wealth essentially also destroyed us in the end because of the pale. So it's interesting that he's alluding to this. The generosity. Basically, we, we corrupted ourselves with their gen generosity. And he's saying, yeah. Though, even it's with my entendre. kin absent, there is great danger in plucking our pelf while foregoing reciprocity. What luck we two are friends that I may beteem this boon unto you. Mm. And since you now possess the means to power it, I have another gift to grant. One more of Robin's favors parceled. The means to construct a portal of one's own. In Aeon's past, portals were notoriously taxing and toilsome for humans to conceive and maintain. However, in the turmoil following the Calamity, I chanced upon a newfangled arch design that dares to make elementary what was once unattainable. You need only seek the materials required to raise this crude apparatus and place the lotus therein. Erecting it will create a contract with this realm's spirits to tame the interrealmic lacuna. Use it well, Realm Walker, that you may yet catch the flown nightingale. That thunder came at the right time. Music. This is a moment that needs ominousness. Can't see the ground. Oh, ow. <laughs> yes, that was amazing. We gotta talk to Mr. Ortega. I should take a quick nap. How you doing? I have completed your second trial. Ah, there it is. But I've been hoping to see you and you all along. The flame of fortitude burning in those lost eyes. Did you feel galvanized as you faced down the phase ancient haunts? Um, I'd be lying if I said I didn't. Aha, so it's possessed you already, the sublime hunger. Well met, well met indeed. Alas, this mentorship comes to its close, for the route of gold becomes, beckons me once more. While there won't be a ceremony, I congratulate you on holding cowardice at bay and completing your trials. I attest that most are not built for realm diving. We'll go through... I'm not going to go through all these. Options. Isn't there a third trial? Ah, yes, yes. However, the third trial, my friend, never ends. It persists for the rest of your days in these realms, for Feywilds are never mastered, never overcome. Now that I trust you not to perish at the first sight of a Carnute, I will be a man of my word. The brash Miss Bly awaits, and so too does Nightingale. Where exactly is Nelly? Last we spoke, Nelly was in a desert herbarium realm, one where scorching dunes could char Lucifer himself. Only Nelly knows why she stationed herself amid such conditions. You should be able to access most of the requisite cards to reach Nelly's camp if you will try it hard enough. If you will it hard enough. 
All straightforward, yes? If there are no more trials, I'll be off. I caution you not to attempt reaching Nelia until survival is second nature. Deserts are notoriously un unforgiving. But do as you will. Should you make it to Quartermain, send the old bastard my regards. I have a feeling he'll make a true walker of you yet. This guy's kind of chatty. May the love of the unknown guide you. May our paths cross get. Okay, so we go back. Because... We pretty much... Well, we can do... We can unlock some stuff here. Like, we should probably beat these occupations. Ooh, a faint portal. Two occupations. Oh, there's two next to each other here. We should go complete a bunch of these things and get some cash going. So we can upgrade our gear. Because... Yeah. Ooh, they got messed up. Let's go back. Drop off our stuff. Home sweet home. Ooh, nickel ore. We didn't really use this after all, but we should probably keep it with us. Well, the problem is I'd rather have the pickaxe. However, we don't really go picking things all the time. We don't break stones all the time. So maybe, maybe we just keep the climbing picks for combat. Oh, we gotta do the astrolabe. Do we have herbarium? I don't think we have that yet. I think... Yeah, we gotta do the side of power first. Which I'm not sure we can quite do yet. I think we need to get our gear score up. How many essences do we have? 212? That's not bad. So... We can do four things. That leaves our tools behind a little bit. But I think we have to do that for there for our, um... For our clothes. Let's do this now. Alright, let's go with our boots first. I'm not sure, but... I'm getting kind of input lag. I'm not sure why. Stealth rating block maximum health. There it is. Alright, next, uh, let's do the gloves. 
Okay, that was weird. I think I had to turn down the lumen a little bit because it was causing some problems. Yeah, it's a bit more responsive now. Excellent. Oh, by the way, the our follower mod kind of disappeared. I disbanded her for a second so that we could like do a sign off, and then the next time we logged in, it was just she was just gone. <laughs> no clue where she went. So um, there's that. Okay, do we do the climbing picks or the knife? If we do the knife melee damage. I think we do the climbing picks because they got a lot of damage. See, 86.4 and it's evasion based. Um, yes, let's do that. That means all of our gear is pretty nice and done now. We could start applying some of those um, Infusions. Forty six equipment rating. Forty seven with our uh, simple wood axe. Which part of me wishes we part of me wishes that this was a better X, but it's it's too late now. Oh, and speaking of which, like you can tell it's better wood from the handles. Like this one's got like a crappy handle, but if I switch to these guys, their handles are so much nicer. See, this is like nice. It's like all gross. These are nice, nice-ish, nicer. Ooh, shrooms. Oh no. DLSS is screwing up. I mean... Performance? It's still going to do that. I think because of Lumen? Yeah, it's Lumen. That does it. Well... It's also kind of intensive. It kicks it up by like... It's kind of frustrating because balance is so much better for performance. Well... We're just gonna have to deal with it. Ugh. That is so not attractive. Let's get this back to balanced. We're just gonna have to deal. Alright, where are we at? Uh, Synchronous Lotus, Mushrooms. So we could go back out there. Hmm. 
Okay, there is one thing I need to do, and that's make some food. Uh, let's grab a couple of these, the barberries. One of them, and one of them. What do we do with the synchronous lotus? I mean, we could make a portal. But do we need to? Maybe we can set one down here. I know there are a few people who make like entire buildings filled with these realm, por realm of portals. And uh, I'm, not a, I'm not a big fan of that. Ooh, we can make some augments. Though they won't really give us much. Crude remote realmic transmuter. Fairy ring. What's this mean? Creatures suppressed. Interesting. Wow, this thing uses up a lot of stuff. Ten lumber, seven ingots, three wires? How do we make wire? Also, what's a fairy ring? Building this structure creates a respawn point for the player who built it. Players will respawn at the nearest fairy ring or respite point to them. Removing the fairy ring will also remove the respawn points. Oh. That's cool. That means if you go to some place, you could set down a fairy ring. So if you die, you can just go back there. You can go back straight away. Um... Hmm. Let's go back to I want to I want to clean out the map. Let's have some snacks first. It's quite the same. Now this rock is going to be frustrating when we build our building because it's going to be in our way. It's all right. Okay, where do we go? To, where do we want to go? Help a survivor construct buildings in exchange for the ability to recruit them, as well as receive essence and resource rewards. Defense, which we're not going to do right now. A couple of occupations and a fey portal. Let's go northwards. Let's go do that. Go around this way and then go up that way. Alright, 
right, let's go. Let's go get these pigs. Got you in the room. There's one more. Right? No? Okay. How you doing? Okay, you need sticks and plant fiber. Ooh. Survivor nearby needs your aid in completing a structure. Help them complete the structure for a reward. Let us begin. Twenty-four sticks, twenty-eight plant fiber. Okay. Right. Should be easy enough. We've got plenty of property and sticks. Twenty-seven thirty. There you go. What you got in your magic chest? Ooh, we got a training dummy. And 32 tier 1 essence. Thank you, kindly. We can also recruit her now, but... Hello, rabbit. Like, do we want to bother recruiting her? Just gonna disappear like Maud, who left us, who, who took our our hammer and our torch and just disappeared into the breeze. Uh, Barbary seeds, okay, I'll take it. Ooh, more Barbary. Excuse me. Hi. Hmm. Nah, we can we can make two without. Although seriously, a one. Really, just one. Or is this a two by two? Oh, it's a one by one. Because the <laughs> the door, one frame. Okay. You know, whatever you need. That's all you need. Then that's all you need. Collect. Thank you. Ooh. A jute seed. Okay, we did that. Let's go east. Let's do these occupations. Hopefully we don't get our asses handed to us. Before we do that though. Our goal here is to get as much tier 1 essence as we can. Oops. Because we are going to need to. We're going to need to bump everything up. And have plenty. Of, ooh, you know what we forgot to do? We forgot to do infusions and enchantments. But we'll do that later. What's this?
suck at four. Oh, there's four of them. Please keep it down. Some of us are trying to explore. Where's the last one? These pigs are, um... They're very territorial. Where'd the last one go? Wasn't it right here? The Notebook of Nellie Bly, November 29th, 1889. It is not long before I come up come upon my first human hamlet, a group of some relations seen plainly in their shared scowls and coarse dark hair. They have been near in the night more than I've ever seen. The fey brood, that is, a young woman said plaintively. But they leave us be so long as we keep the land about the house well lit. The family have boarded the farm windows with garden fencing. I share their supper broth and sour black bread. What do you know of them? They're not men, nor even used to be. Don't even know they're fey maid. Not for certain, an older woman said, with a sharp scowl to the younger. They and beasts kill one another, but neither gets a meal from it. One of the men spit three times. To fend off the eye, he explained sourly. Have you seen other people from the city, I asked? You are the only one. I came back to the hamlet days later. The people are gone, the buildings, des the buildings deserted. A titillix mocking laughter echoes from behind the splintered door. That's ominous. I want to chop this stuff down. We got carved wood, hardwood, and regular old lumber, and crude cloth. Okay. Uh, where'd we go in? Eastwards, towards the occupation. Do we have to go inside? Is there an inside? Oh, there is an inside. What is that? I think that's- I think this is tin. What is this? Shiitake. Oh, we're gonna need... Oh man, if only we had... That's not gonna do anything. soon.
Oh, he's a flame guy. Two of them? Oh, no, no, no. It's just regular dudes. I want a headshot on that guy, but... Someone's in the way. Oh, hi. Oh, shit. Come fight me out here. Away from your friends. Ow. Oops. there's some out here. Well, we couldn't even pick this anyways because we didn't have, we don't have a 40 ranked pick. Don't have enough uh, essence to upgrade it. Actually, let's look. Do we have enough now? We do. So we could go and come back. But let's clear this place out first if we can. the uh, bomb thrower guys are called. Haha, <laughs> got you in the face though. Oh shit. There was a lot more than I realized. so frustrating like it's doing frame skips I guess when he's around like stop it
repair. I don't hear anyone else, so that's good. Oh, but there's... even ground. <laughs> Where's this place go though? Where's it go? Enemies everywhere. No, no, that guy's in the room. seems to fight. Okay, we need more food. Let's 
Excuse me. Oh shit. This larger room, I suppose. Oh, okay. I thought that was a hole. Just, just water. I guess they don't like that area. I can get, can't get too much further because you're running out of supplies. Do I have more to deal with? I don't hear anything. Excuse me. Over here, we may as well do this. And as well grab all that stuff for the time. Hopefully we don't get overburdened. Regular wood, regular sandstone, regular rocks. We can probably just scrap all that. Same with the plant fiber, if we want to. If we need space. What's our weight? 64. We're good. We're good for now. get down normally. Oh, down here. Excuse me, rabbit. Poisonous buckshot. We can also... Something I found out as well is that you can chop these down for great resources apparently
That actually got us some pretty good stuff. We got gilded lumber, a hinge, carved wood out of hardwood. Yeah, that's actually pretty... that's solid. Take those essences. Thank you very much. It is much appreciated. Oh, this must have opened. It's alright, we'll take a look in a second. Excuse me, rabbits. Why is this sparkly? Alright, let's keep on going. Oh, we don't have a pick. little place to stop. Let's take a little, quick little nap. Do we have any food we can make? Ooh, we can make healing salve. How much do we have? Eh, not a lot. Let's not waste that. How about plants? What can we do? Barberries. Okay. Meat. Eh, we don't need to do that, any of that. 25 wood bundles. Let's take it. Wouldn't want to waste it. Is this going to lead us to more fighting? Because, um... Oh, boars. Wait, why is there a jump here? This is a jump, right? Why? Why is there a jump here? Or is that the farthest they can get? I think we have to jump down. Alright, I think we're actually going to stop it for now. 
we're going to do is we're going to go back to the advanced realm and then we'll come back to this place because this is um i didn't expect it to be quite so in depth all right let's put our goods away all of our all of our gains um we brought the synchronous lotus with us oops that was a mistake what is this? Coal? Put that there. Oops, not the meat. Thanks for the hinges. We may as well put the synchronous lotus in here too. Seeds. We're actually accruing quite a lot of seeds. That's kind of nice to see. three barbarians or mixed plants out of barbarians we are going to want to make some healing stuff Oop, we actually need three of these Okay, we need to change our loadout. This wasn't very helpful for us, even though it's kind of nice. We're going to have to go to with our mining. Alright, let's get... We don't want all of that. We only want about five of these and five of these. Uh, let's put the rest of this away. All right, we're gonna need some. And I'll take a few seconds and, this, and that's let's use the time to upgrade this guy. Or do we make a better pick? No, it's not bothering. We may as well do the knife as well. And then we'll do the umbrella. Get the fuck out of there. There we go. Oops, we don't want to go there, we want to go here. Ooh, and with let's also grab a bunch of these and see if we can apply them to anything. Let's see, uh, weight, which we. Where can we apply this? Oh, we can apply it to anything. Okay. Let's give it to the backpack, maybe? Yeah. Very nice. Uh, fire resist. Mm, that could help. Poison resistance, stamina efficiency, movement speed. Let's do movement speed. Let's put it on our umbrella. Sure. Stamina efficiency. Let's put it. Oh man. 
I was hoping it would, it would go into clothing rather than weaponry. About poison resist, can't apply, can't apply that either. Okay, okay. Maybe we do add it to this sickle? Yeah, why not? Yeah, why not? Oh, you know what we don't have? We don't have a fishing rod. We need wood, animal fiber, bones. Fair enough. What do we need for animal fiber? Uh, wait, let's get some wood first. Let's get one of these tier ones. Let's get a better plant fiber. Please. We needed two of these. Oh, no, we didn't even need it. We need animal fiber. And bugs. Okay. We're just gonna need one of these. I'm doing this because of stamina. But a fishing when you're fishing, stamina is more important than health. So we want to have more stamina. Okay, what do we need for animal fiber? Meat, I think. Meat. Oh, that only makes one. And we need two of them. Okay, max stamina, stamina regen. Cool. Do we have enough stuff? We do. Very cool. Now we're gonna need this charm. Charm of Endless Fishing. Charm grants a damage boost to the wearer when they next emote. Don't need that. Grants an immense boost to damage when the wearer damages one creature with two different weapon types. That's cool. Restores the wearer's stamina each time they fell a tree. That's really cool. Okay, let's apply this charm to this. Can we apply this? Oh, we can't apply it. I mean, we could apply it to our clothes and stuff. What are, what are the other ones? Morale. No. Two different weapon types. Um, this could work on the bow or the sling bow. Let's actually see. Can we apply it to the sling bow? We can. 
Let's do that, because then we'll do the piercing with the bow and then slashing with the axe. Cool. Uh, four snow. We could put this on something like pants, boots, gloves. Shirt, hat. Let's hang on to the charm for now. And we'll do our fishing later on. I'm still gonna create a um like a little fishing shack right over there. But for now, I think we're gonna stop for today. Let's go somewhere, look at something really cool looking. Before we sign off. Not a bad view, right? Actually, let's look this way. Ooh, the light's not so great. Alright, we're gonna have to deal with deal with just a beautiful vista to look at. Ah, we were actually pretty productive today. Um, I did not expect to go through the uh, Fate Tower that, quite that quickly, so that's a nice bonus. Um, I was expecting a much, much longer fight. But hey, we did it well. And we went through that little underground dungeon thing, which we need to go back and finish. Uh, but for now, um, I'm just going to sign off. Hope you all enjoyed this, the episode, and I'll catch you all next time, alright? Peace.